So I'm going to start to the right hand side here and cha cha. One, two, three, 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 cha cha. One. Again, you can rewatch this a little bit later so uh, we can move on now. And then, so what we're going to do afterwards. I want to show you another step that we're going to combine all of them together at the very end. So we're going to have kind of like a little routine that you can practice even at home during this, these strange times and uh, it, doesn't stay, it doesn't take really much of a place for that. Now another step that I want to do is a Kuban breaks. I'm going to start standing on my right foot. My left foot is here on the side or like Kyle would do, or he would say which way is the beach? It's actually that way. Okay, so we're gonna try this now. So I'm gonna go left foot forward. I go two and three and cha cha one. And I'm gonna do exactly the same thing going to this side. Two and three and cha cha one. I finish my movement on one. I'm standing on my right foot. And then I start over again with my left foot forward. I go two and three and cha cha one and then again this side two and three and cha cha one well i don't know about you guys but i'm having fun here all <laughs> by myself now i'm going to turn around i'm going to show you the same thing uh from the other angle so i'm starting on my right foot and i'm going to start moving with my left foot forward two and three and cha cha one two Three and cha cha. One more time. Two and three and cha cha. One, two and three and cha cha. One. So this is what's important in this position. The same thing. The way we're shifting our body weight. As I'm stepping forward, this is called a check. I want you to stand on your left foot here. So as you can see, my hip is kind of going to the left side a little bit because my body weight is mostly on my left foot. It's important that you have your knees together so you feel more secure. And now, so I'm gonna move on. So this is the first step too. Then I'm going to the side, three, and I'm, I'm going again, cha, cha, and I'm gonna land all the way on my left foot here. My body weight is on my left foot and I'm gonna do the same thing going this side. So I'm going on my right foot, two, and three, and cha, Cha, one. Let's do that again. I'm gonna do from this side now. I'm gonna start right foot and then left foot goes forward. And two and three and cha, cha, one. All my body weight is on my left foot in this case. And now two and three and cha, cha, one. Just like that. Yes, Kyle, I hope you're watching. I hope you're really, really watching. And I bet you're commenting right now. I'm really sure you are. Okay. Now, this is what we're going to do. Hilarious, you are. Uh, we're going to do this from the beginning. We're going to connect those two steps for now, okay? Feet together. I'm going to start to the right side from the beginning with the basic step. Cha cha one. Two, three, cha cha one. Forward. Two, three, cha cha. One, two. Three, one more time, cha, cha, one backwards. And now I'm gonna go cha, cha, one, and I'm gonna start with scoop and breaks. I'm gonna go two and three and cha, cha, one on my left foot, and I'm going here, two and three and cha, cha, one. After this, I did it two times, then I'm gonna go into the beginning. Two, three, cha, cha, one, into the basic step for now. Now I'm going to show the same thing facing this direction. From the beginning, I'm going to go to the right side. Cha cha, one, two, three, cha cha, one, two, three, cha cha, one, two, three, let's do one more. Cha, one, two, three, cha cha, one, and now we're going to do a movement breaks. Two and three and cha cha, one, two, and three and cha cha one and then i go from the beginning two three cha cha one 
Uh, so if we're counting this, I have a basic step. Forward, backward, forward, backwards. So it's four times total. And afterwards, I'm going to do two times scoop and brace. One to the right and one to the left. At the very end, I'm going to show this entire small routine a little bit faster. Now, what I want to do actually at the, at the very end here, after we're going to do our two uh, Cuban breaks here, two and three and cha-cha. This is first. Now, two and three and cha-cha. One. This is second. At the very end, I really want you to make sure that your entire body weight here sits on your right foot. So your left foot is free to go and then you can start this from the beginning. Meaning you can go two, three, and then I go cha-cha one from the beginning. Okay. Now, so this is like I was talking in the very beginning. The main thing is the way we're shifting our body weight. So as you can see, my hips are moving. Not just because I heard, I bet you heard many times from me and from other teachers, we need to work on your hips. And yes, we need to work on your hips, but it needs to happen naturally. Instead of really forcing or trying to take example from someone when we don't really understand how it needs to be done. So that's why I think it's so important that we're starting the shifting weight and we're making it more naturally. So I'm gonna try now to do it a little bit faster. Come along, you can do it with me and I'm gonna face them that way so you can learn this routine and keep working on this uh, by yourself at home and you can rewatch the video again like we were talking about before. So from the beginning again, cha cha one, two, three, cha cha one backwards, two, three, cha cha one, two, three, cha cha one, Two, and I'm gonna go into the Cuban breaks now. And two, and three, and cha, cha, one. Two, and three, and cha, cha, one. All my body weight goes on my right foot, and then I start from the beginning. Two, three, cha, cha, one. I think I'm gonna turn around, it's gonna be a little bit easier. So I'm gonna do it a couple times without stopping now. Because all I've been doing until now is just stopping here. I know I'm bothering you guys. Okay, we're gonna do it from the beginning. So, we're gonna go here, cha cha one, two, three, 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 cha cha Cuban breaks, two and three and cha cha one, two and three and cha cha one, beginning, two, three, cha cha one, two, three, cha cha one, two, three, Cha cha one, two, three, good and breaks. Two and three and cha cha one, two and three and cha cha. Beginning. Two, three, cha cha one. Yes. So this will be a very short routine, but it's something not about the steps necessarily. It's more about the way I want you to start working on, like we talked before, shifting your body weight and involving your hips while doing that. The last point that I wanted actually to do is while I'm doing the Cuban breaks, I was talking about finishing and transferring my entire body weight, whether it's on my right foot or my left foot. But what happens here in between, let me show you. So I go all the way forward, and as I'm going to the side, here, I'm going only on the ball of my foot. So you don't need to go on your flat foot here to the side in the first place. As I'm going to the side, I'm placing only the ball of my foot. I go on my flat foot, and then at the very end, I go all the way because I'm making transition to the other side. Let me show you this in a slow motion. Two and three. This is the position I was talking about. I'm standing there here basically just on the ball of my foot. And then cha, cha, and then one here. I'm standing on completely on my flat foot here, even though the most of my body weight is still on the ball of my foot and this toe is going to be pointed. The same thing on this direction. Two and three, the ball, and then cha, cha, one, flat. Yes. All right, guys. Uh, I don't see the screen. I have no idea what's going on there. I bet Kyle is just having a lot of fun there and enjoying himself and probably just talking to himself like he does that every day. Thank God no one is looking and no one is listening to that right now. Uh, so thank you for tuning in. And thank you for watching. I hope you find it useful. And then uh, we're hoping to see you soon, sooner than later, 
On Friday, we have another live class. I believe Jan will be doing that, so that will be really exciting. I think it's also at noon, so stay tuned and hope to see you soon, sooner than later. Thank you.